the male reproductive system. This is the penis, prepuce, testicle, epididymis. Around the testicle and epididymis is the scrotum. This is the spermatic cord. Inside of the spermatic cord is the ductus deferens. And there's also blood vessels and nerves. If you follow the ductus, uh, the spermatic cord around, you'll see the ductus deferens. This is the urinary bladder. Coming off the urinary bladder is the ureter. That leaves urine from the kidneys to the urinary bladder. Urinary bladder, below that is the prostate gland, and this is a seminal vesicle. Now if we take this part off, inside the penis, you can see the corpus cavernosum, the urethra. Around the urethra is the corpus spongios. And let's take off this part, flip it around, and let's move over here. Well, let's go ahead and do it this way. Here we can see the seminal vesicle. There's the ductus deferens where the seminal vesicle and the ductus deferens fuse together is called the ejaculatory duct. There's the urinary bladder. Underneath the urinary bladder is the prostate gland. And this is the urethra going through the prostate gland. You can see different views of the same thing. And there's the urinary bladder. Behind the urinary bladder is the rectum. Again, you can see prostate gland, the urethra running through the prostate gland, and the ejaculatory duct. Another part of the male reproductive system, this part goes in the big torso model. And again, we have the urinary bladder prostate gland, urethra, ejaculatory duct. The urethra goes along this way, and this is the glands of the penis, corpus cavernosum, corpus spongiosum, testicle, epididymis, scrotum. Now one thing that's unique that you can see on this model, if we look right here, there's the urethra. Here's this little piece coming off the urethra. This is the bulbal urethral gland. And it's the only model where we can see the bulbal urethral gland. That is.